Emma McQuaid and I'm Ireland's fittest female. Um, as a sport, it is everything. There's swimming, running, biking, there's been paddle boarding, uh, outdoor boat rowing is coming up for the first time ever. Like we've been on mountain bikes around Punchestown Racecourse in a competition there two weeks ago, which was really cool. Uh, gymnastics is a huge element, uh, getting to learn to walk on your hands and now walking over obstacles, like that's, that's something I never thought was possible. Obviously weightlifting's in there. It's basically anything that involves fitness, uh, that, that, that's CrossFit. It definitely makes you proud. Um, it was a dream back in 2014 whenever I first started. I got to compete against the Ireland's fittest female at the time. And at the, whenever I was competing against her, I was like, wow, this is absolutely impossible. Um, I don't know how I'll ever get to this level. So to be Ireland's fittest female now for the last two years, it's, it's been absolutely amazing. And obviously what comes along with that, being Ireland's fittest female, you get to qualify to go to the CrossFit Games and you get to obviously like walk out onto the floor with thousands of people watching you, holding the flag. It was definitely one of the proudest moments in my sporting career. Um, like from a young age, like fitness has always been a part of my life, but it hasn't been like the sole part of my life. Um, it's always been, I needed to get fit for Gaelic, or I needed to get fit for cross country running, or get fit for quad racing, which was my previous sport. So fitness wasn't like the main thing. It was just to facilitate what I was looking to do. And then obviously now for fitness to be the sole thing in my life, um, it, it's, it, it's different, but I, I enjoy it. Yeah, like um, CrossFit as a sport is completely different to CrossFit health and fitness. Um, like recently, <clears throat> it took five years to get my sister into CrossFit, um, but re like they're like four, three, four months ago, um, I finally bullied my sister into starting. Uh, I went to the first class with her. I was her partner in the class and she was like, oh, I'm gonna hold you back. And I was like, no, you're not. I was like, you do what you can do and I'll do my side. And like, I was busted after the workout and she was also busted. So like, and she is like a mother of two, works a full-time job, hasn't probably done any exercise from, she played netball in high school. So like, that's a good, I don't know, she's 32, so I'm not good at maths. Um, so is it, like, it's, it's a good while ago from she's done anything and now she loves it. Um, so like, I think you can start at any level, in any shape, any, like, any way, and be capable of doing it. Um, health and fitness side of CrossFit, uh, I don't think it's spoken about enough. You don't need to be fit to start, you just need to be willing to walk through the doors and take part.